Grabe, super sharp. The reason why I got another iPhone 14 Pro Max is... So here we have the brand new iPhone 14 Pro Max. Ang kinuha namin color is deep purple. Chris said, why did you buy another iPhone? I thought meron ka na. Hey you, subscribe. Ang di mag-subscribe, di masarap ulam. Ang plan ko is sa smart, so every two years, nagpapalit ako ng phone. Supposedly, December ko siya makukuha, pero dahil nga walang stock, dahil madaming kumuha ng iPhone nung Christmas, I've been wanting yung silver color. For some reason, hindi available lang silver color in 1 terabyte dito sa Pinas. Parang ang hirap niyang hanapin. I really wanted something different kasi lagi na lang space gray yung kulay ng iPhone ko. So, our contact from smart offered this one kasi ang tagal ko na talaga nag-pre-order, December pa. He contacted us, in-offer niya to sa akin yung deep purple kasi deep purple lang daw yung dumating and there are only two units na dumating sa uh, smart na yon. Kinuha na namin dalawa ng mama ko, nagkasabay pang nag-renew yung plan namin. So ayan, mag-shoutout muna tayo sa mga comments sa last video. So shoutout kay Vinch, Arjun Mark, Kiano, Dane, Ross Tom, Joshua, Isabel, Mark Gerard, Jamela, Josefina, Aliana, Erica, Walter, Adrian, and lastly kay Frank. So ayan, kung gusto nyo mo shoutout sa next video, mag-comment na kayo down below ng iPhone. So ayan, kung gusto nyo mo shoutout, mag-comment na kayo. And yeah, back to the video. So let's unbox it pala. Although nag-unboxing na tayo sa channel na to, if you haven't watched it yet, Tenen, wala siyang laman. <laughs> Actually, ito na yung laman niya kasi ginamit ko na talaga. San kayo nakakitang unboxing na nasa labas na yung ina-unbox? Dito lang yan sa channel na to. So, ang inclusion sa iPhone 14 Pro Max is, we have a cord. It's USB-C to Lightning cord. So, I wish talaga na USB-C to USB-C na. Pero, rumor has it, yung next generation ng iPhone will have USB-C charging. So, next, we have, syempre yung mga papers. We have yung Apple sticker. So, yung pantusok na sim. Ayan. And other paperworks. Mga manual ganun. Along with it, I also bought Tastify cases. I ordered this last year pa kasi I was really anticipating na makakakuha na ako ng iPhone 14. The first one is wala na. Gamit ko na siya. So this is the Alicia Marie X Tastify case. So ganyan yung packaging ng Tastify. Next case naman, I have this one. So nakasulat dito is My therapist and I talk shit about you. <laughs> this is actually another collaboration ni Alicia Marie and Castify. Alicia Marie is one of my favorite international YouTubers. Super happy ako na nakapag-collab sila ng Castify kasi I really, really love Castify. In this video, I will be trying out the camera quality of photos and video. I also vlog with my phone. Lagi ako nag-video with my phone kasi, di ba nga nag-vlog tayo yung life after college and new house update. Pag wala akong dalang camera, syempre wala akong choice to use my phone. Pero ang ganda na kasi ng quality talaga ng iPhone camera. Ta try natin kung mas maganda pa dito sa iPhone 14 Pro Max kasi the last unboxing I did hindi talaga ako nag camera test wala talaga akong ginawa unboxing lang talaga so eto parang review na siya ng camera quality vlogging and all so yun na nga we're gonna do a camera test of the brand new iPhone 14 Pro Max as you can see here dito sa mga photo samples grabe super sharp and super crisp na mga photos ngayon as in it blew my mind kasi sabi ko dun pa lang sa 12 Pro Max ko before parang it's okay na hindi ko expect na may igaganda pa pala people are hating on the iPhone 14 Pro Max kasi sabi parang wala naman difference from the past generations parang wala naman pinagbago as a person na mahilig talaga mag picture I could see a huge difference super sharp na ng quality ng camera ng iPhone 14 I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing kasi sa mga 
mga selfies talaga. Kita na lahat. Kita na lahat ng mali ko sa mukha. I don't know if it's a good thing, pero it's a good thing na maganda yung quality ng camera. Am I right? In terms of the video naman, I really, really love the quality as well. Dati, I hated the front cam ng iPhone 12 Pro Max. I never vlog with the front cam. Lagi akong back cam. Pero this time, yung front cam nitong iPhone na to, my God, I could vlog with it na kasi super ganda. Vlog test with the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Hi! How's the camera quality? Maganda ba? O oh, mukha ko. Parang ang ganda naman ng front cam. Parang pwede na mag-vlog ng ganda to ko. Ito naman di na o. Oh. Hi guys! It's me Cedric. This is the front cam quality. What do you guys think? Siyempre! Dahil maganda yung front cam, mas maganda yung back cam. Back cam quality, wide lens. How is it? Okay ba? Ganda ba? I'm not sure. Hindi ko nakikita yung sarili ko pero this is the back cam 0.5. This is the back cam regular. Ayan yung regular na classic na camera ng video ng iPhone na to. So, I don't have the 12 Pro Max na to do a comparison, pero the cameras here are much bigger. As in, ang laki-laki ng camera nito. Tapos, I feel like the audio is so much better now. As in, yung speakers na and yung microphone, parang mas rich yung tunog. I don't know if nalumaan na lang yung luma kong camera, pero I'm really enjoying this phone right now. So, I'm gonna show you guys what's on my iPhone. So, First, yan lock natin. So, ito pala yung aking lock screen. So, it's just a picture of me. Tapos, inedit ko ng purple yung Skype. So, ang first page, makikita nyo may chicken. This is the app Locket. Para siyang IG stories, pero with your closest friends. So, ang pwede mo lang i-add dito is 20 people. So, ang naka-add ko dito is my closest, closest friends. Tapos yun, dito ko na-update yung mga friends ko with what's happening. Mga kalokohan lang talaga between close friends talaga. So, I really, really love that app kasi very intimate niya. Nakikita nyo naman, very purple ng ating layout. I feel like pag nagpalit ako ng phone case, pa palitan ko din yung layout kasi mahilig talaga ako mag layout layout ng ganyan so it's not an issue for me kahit baguhin ko yung phone ko purple muna tayo to go with the theme so settings FaceTime voice memos when I need to record something notes syempre very important tong notes na to kaya nandyan siya sa first page Safari App Store Broom Broom and Clock so itong Broom Broom na to this is actually my car keys kasi yung car ko pwede siyang i-control using the phone I have two widgets met one day at a time nakasulat kasi this quote really resonated with me kasi all my life I, I've always been an overachiever. Pinapressure ko yung sarili ko lagi. So this just reminds me na take it easy. Maabot mo din yung mga goals mo kumbaga. Tapos meron lang tayong langit dyan. <laughs> Very random. Parang aesthetic lang siya. Below we have iMessage, contacts, images, and camera. Ito talaga mga lagi kong ginagamit always. Makikita nyo, purple din yung mga emojis na ginamit ko for the folders kasi I have here yung mga classic na ginagamit nating social media. I associate these apps sa cuddle weather. For some reason, Spotify, YouTube. Next naman, I have my Gastos app. So, andito si Shopee. Andito yung isa. Gcash, BPI, Metrobank, PDO, Paymaya, MySmart, Carousel, Eastwest. But may Pixart dito. I don't know why Pixar, may Pixart dito. I'm gonna remove it. Ang random na tong eggplant na to kasi wala ng purple na emoji. So, we have here my trans transportation, my logistics app. We have here a widget smith ulit. So, nakasulat dito, it's okay to not have it all figured out. Below it, meron akong calendar kasi I really need this calendar talaga. Tapos, we have here, gumagalaw na clock. Nakutean lang ako and it's purple. I really don't play mobile games that much na. Pero if I do, I mostly play Wild Rift. Tapos, meron pang MN. Siyempre, hindi mamawala yung MN. Ano ba? Photography folder. So, ito talaga yung dito nakalagay yung mga uh, nako, camera apps and mga photo editing apps. So, ang ginagamit ko mostly is Visco. Dati Lightroom ako pero iba talaga yung editing sa Visco. Student folder. Ito yung, mga, ito yung mga ginagamit ko when I was a student. I have a widget smith na malaki 
nakasulat dito, make your future self proud. Tapos below we have Eric Nam na nakaganyan. Ang cute lang ng picture ni Eric Nam na to as in, parang nakutan lang ako so I put it as my widget smith. So yun lang ang ating what's on my iPhone. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video kahit nagkaroon na tayo ng iPhone 14 video before. So yun na nga, if you like this video, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe and hit the notification bell para hindi kayo makamiss ng video ni Kuya Sen. And that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching and always remember that it is okay to be a weirdo. Bye!